God. Hold up, here's the best part. Here's the best part. Flooding in. How is everybody doing on this fan fucking tastic Wednesday? I am live five minutes late. For the people that are saying late, I am barely fucking late, bitch. Relax. I have been hours late before. I am five minutes late from my scheduled time. It is not that big of a deal. You sat here for five fucking minutes, buddy. Oh my god. Anyways. How's everybody doing on this fantastic fucking Wednesday? And now y'all are going to spam late because that's what y'all do. You just try to piss me off. Anyways, we're playing FMV games today. If you don't know what an FMV game is, it's basically a movie game, right? It's genuine actors. It's not graphics, right? So they actually film a movie and there's a bunch of points where you make decisions and those decisions lead to different sex in the movie, which lead to different endings. The reason we're technically in just chatting right now is because you guys are going to pick what FMV game we play today. I have three options. I'm going to read the description of each game. You guys are going to listen, and then you're going to pick the game that we play. Is that good, chat? Yes or no? We're going to do a poll, too, so don't be spamming. One! One! The first one! The first one, don't spam that, okay? So we're going to do a poll so you don't need to do that shit, okay? I'm going to read the description of each game. You're going to remember them, right? Because you have a memory, you have a brain. And then you're going to fucking pick which one you want me to play today. Eventually, we're probably all going to... Okay, now y'all are going to spam one. You don't even know what the fucking games are. One could be the worst option, chat. You don't even know what one is. You don't even know what one is, chat. You're just spamming one. Okay, anyways. JDW for the sub, Hot Wheels for the sub, Brayden and more for the sub, Squid for the sub, DJ for the, uh, the thousand biddies, not 300 bets. First time donating, I'm about to finish seven and a half hellish weeks of military training. Holy shit. First time back, what did I miss? I died in the Minecraft hardcore world like four times. We have this, I'm on like my fourth Minecraft hardcore world. That's basically all you've missed. Other than reactions and maybe some like other FMV games... Little Hope playthrough, few things. Uh, but congrats on almost finishing. Yaporio for the sub, DS for the 3 inch bitties. Big Daddy Carson and Aware for the subs. Tiptoe for the 3 inch bitties, becoming a recognizable chatter slash donor. Uh, yeah, I remember your name for sure. Pinky for the sub, Epic for the 3 inch bets. Got Gorilla Glue Hybrid 94 THC 1.5 gram THC vape. I was faded as fuck. Were you in Yodi land? PB and Charlie for the sub. Amelia for the uh, 700 bitties. Did you stop at Blinkerton? Anyways. <laughs> had a big eye surgery today, so I can't really see anything. <clears throat> How did you type that message? If you can't see anything. Mora for the sub. Brayden for the sub. Generic for the uh, fucking sub. Uh, and I hope the fucking surgery went well. Bode for the 500 bitties. All right, chat. Can I read the description of each game and you guys are going to tell me which one we play? Everybody shut up. Everybody lock in. Type locked in so you fucking pay attention to me, right? Because y'all zone out. I know y'all zone out because you type off-topic shit. Everybody fucking pay attention. Locked in. I'm going to read the description of each game, and you're going to tell me which one you want to play, okay? Starting off, number one, Super Seducer, How to Talk to Girls. Learn state-of-the-art seduction secrets from the master himself, Richard LaRuna, in this incredibly valuable live-action seduction simulator. It's TOS? Stop! Y'all always tell me shit is TOS. Bro, is it actually? It's not in the banned games list. I fucking looked. Second. Second. One of my mods look into whether or not Super Seducer is TOS. Second. Breakout 13. Breakout is a narrative adventure game with interactive cinematic experience. It's about a group of misguided youths who are sent to a correctional center where they are tortured and try to escape. That's two. Number three, The Shapeshifting Detective is a supernatural murder mystery FMV game where you play as a detective 
who can shapeshift into other characters, allowing you to unlock secret conversations and private encounters. Run the poll. Run the poll on one, two, or three, right? Number one, number one, super seducer. Number two, breakout 13. It Keep in mind, chat, breakout 13 is in, is in Japanese. Forgot to mention that. Break Number two, we have to read subtitles. You already forgot. Okay, well, Super Seducer, number one. Number two, Breakout 13, the one where they're sent to, a, like, basically a torture correctional center and they try to escape. Number three, Shapeshifting Detective. Y'all really gonna vote for the Riz one? Every time. I knew I didn't even need to run this poll. I literally talked to my mods about this, and they all, I already knew y'all were going to pick that one. I already knew y'all were going to pick that one. Like, it's not even... It wasn't even a fucking... It wasn't... I, I literally was like, yeah, I'm going to run the poll on the offshoot chance they pick out... Like, like, I really knew that Breakout 13 and Shapeshifting Detective are really good, right? They look really good. I do really... Yo, chat, can we play... I'm not going to play Breakout 13 because y'all voted for Super Seducer... Would you guys be okay with playing it one day, even though it's in Japanese? Or are you guys going to be a bunch of losers about it? Right? Let me show you the preview. Hold up. Oh, God. You can't see anything. It's like Squid Games. It's like watching, like, it's like watching, uh, like, subtitles. Oh, it's Chinese, not Japanese? That's my bad. That is actually my bad. I'm sorry for that. I didn't know. I don't know the difference. I don't know the difference. I just loaded up the game, and I saw symbols, and I assumed they were Japanese symbols. That is my apologies. That's not Chinese. How is that racist? I don't know the language. Yo, y'all are bugging. Yo, y'all are pissing me the fuck off. If you looked at... Bro, I loaded up the game, and the... Nah, I'm literally about to show y'all. I'm about to show y'all so you can shut the fuck up. I'm actually about to show y'all so you can shut the fuck up. We're going to play Super Seducer, but like, yo, nah, y'all are actually pressing me now. Y'all are trying, yo, y'all are actually a bunch of gaslighters. Big and X2 for the sub, Big Daddy for the 500 bets. Bro, look, when I launch the game, this is what I see. This is what I see. I launch the game, I see this. I don't know the difference I don't, I don't, I can't tell. I can't tell whether or not, you know what I mean? And I don't even know. And then I started, fi I started fiddling with the settings. Finally found this one. It switched it to English. If I, like, Jesus Christ. I literally just started pressing random buttons. I was re, I, I had no idea what the fuck I was looking at. Anyways, we're going to play Super Seducer. This is kinda long but, I can speak for majority of the people in this chat when I say that your streams genuinely make my day and makes the bad days better. 2022 was a terrible year for me and it came with a lot of loss, but view But viewing your streams have always made me laugh and helped me through that. I'm very much honored and appreciative to, appreciative to be considered a VIP in your chat. And I couldn't, I could not be more thankful for that. These 20,000 bits are a way to say thank you not only on my, and then it cut off. Dude, thank you for the fucking 20,000 bits, Bobat. And that was also another dub for quite possibly one of the best messages I've ever received. Thank you. I, I am genuinely grant, I'm genuinely grateful that I can make your guys' day. Somebody said you're still a racist. You don't even know how to spell racist, number one, you dumb cuck. Number two, I'm not racist. I didn't know what language it was because I don't speak anything other than English and I launched the game and I can't tell what language it's in. So I assumed it was Japanese because Japan has a lot of video game companies. So it was a fucking educated guess that it was Japanese. You dumbass, okay? Moving on, Bobat underscore underscore, Fa or Boba T. I know it's Boba T, but you say I should call you Bobat. Anyways, thank you for the tw- <gasps> Bro, bro, are you fucking kidding me? You you could have sent 300 biddies for the fucking next one. <laughs> and we're close to the 10,000 biddies too. Oh my God. Oh my God. What the fuck? What the fuck, dude? 
Spill bath for the 20,000 bits, another 10,000 bits, and we're full for the 10,000 bitties. Same thing for having me as a VIP. You saved my year. I was suicidal in your streams. Help me a lot, W. Joe. Oh, my God, bro. Oh, my God, dude. I have been live for 10 minutes, and y'all have sent me 40,000 fucking bits, Guillaume Ledebilly. Bobat for the second 10,000 biddies. Holy shit. These 30,000 bits are just a way to say thank you. Not only on my behalf, but on behalf of everyone else in chat. As well as the ones that don't have the funds to give bits and say the same thing or to express their gratitude You don't to need you. to give bits, bro. You didn't need to do that. I am insanely thankful that you gave me that 30,000 bits, bro. I, you didn't need to send me that. I, bro, I'm, I thank you. Holy shit. That is so many fucking bits. And what a nice fucking message, dude. Express their gratitude to you. Keep doing what you do on Twitch and TikTok. You're an inspiration to a lot of people, including myself. I will also be gifting 40 subs because I love chat and speaking to them every time I come here, even the ones that hate me. <laughs> I don't know why, why some chatters have a gripe with you. It's not like a two-inch scenario where, like, like two-inch has on multiple occasions said, fuck you, chat. Like, you've never been disrespectful to chat, and they just shit on you sometimes, which makes no sense. But, bro, thank you for the fucking 30,000 bits, Bobat. And thank you, Werfel, for the 10,000 bitties, and there's the 40 fucking gifteds. Oh, my God. Thank Bobat if you got a sub from them. That is 40 fucking subs. 40 people just got for free. If you're one of them, thank Bobat for the fucking subs. Holy fucking shit, dude. That is so many fucking subs. I'm missing so many donos, too. Boat for the 300 bits. Choji for the 300 bits. Generic for, and uh, MKU for the sub. Willis for the sub. Skills for the 300 bits. How do I wipe my ass? Oh, brother. How did you even... You know how to type, but you don't know how to wipe your ass. Evan and Joe for the sub. Yo, what age did you guys have your parents stop wiping your ass? I don't even know. I just remember, bro, like, I remember genuinely, like, having my parents wipe my ass. Like, that was the weirdest thing ever. Like, that was, like, like that was so weird. Like, the fact that we couldn't wipe... I, it wasn't... I, I think parents wipe their kids' asses when they're young... Because not because they don't know how to wipe their own ass because they're definitely not going to get all the shit out of their ass. You know what I mean? Like when I was four, if I was tasked with wiping my own ass, I would definitely have had shit in my ass like all day. Like there's no doubt. Like there's no doubt I would have not. I you Because bro, like now, now, yo, this is a TMI. I'll wipe that shit till I bleed, bro. I'm not having shit in my ass. That's fucking disgusting. I will wipe that shit fucking clean. Look at the mod Discord, bro. Nah, not till I bleed like bad, bro. But like, you know what I mean? Like, if you do like, if you do like a four wipe and then you're just like, ah, oh, I think I'm good. That's disgusting. I checked it. Uh, Manny said, I checked it. Says that Super Seducer one and two are good to stream on Twitch. Super Seducer three is TOS. Okay, so, so we can play Super Seducer 1 and 2. We cannot play Super Seducer 3. Okay, dub. All right, well, that's a dub. We'll be able to play the game. Casey for the 300 bits. It snowed in Ireland. I live on top of a mountain, so imagine how my walk uh, went getting to school on the ice. You had to walk to school going down a mountain on ice? Yeah, that was probably a fucking adventure. Yellow for the 300 bits. Found my stuff that was stolen today. Found it in somebody's storage room. What the fuck? X2 for the sub. Big Daddy for the five, 500 bits. Thought I used, would use daddy's money real quick. Any thoughts on me taking my girlfriend to Denny's? While I am a fan of Denny's, <coughs> if, you, if you take a girl out to eat to Denny's, they will never date you again, okay? Um, Denny's has possibly the worst service ever. No matter what Denny's franchise you go to, the workers take five hours to make a pancake, okay? Uh, they're also usually rude, uh, so I don't think you should go to a Denny's. I think that's a bad play. Maybe order Denny's. I don't know about going there. Big man for the sub, not for the three bits. Apples are snack dub. Is it a fun vibey today? Fun vibe today? I don't know. I mean, we'll see how the FMV game goes. 
Billy on TV for the fucking five gifteds. I think you said another five too that I missed. Think of the fucking ten gifteds, Philly and TV. Billy on TV. I don't know if I'm fucking saying that right. Dub in the chat for that too. Two inch for the three inch bets. You're really playing a super seduction game when I'm in chat. I'm literally the Riz Lord. I know all the tips and tricks. I literally have a date tonight. I'm the Rizzler. You, my army, will riz up everything. Bro, come on. Bobat, again, thank you for the fucking 40, 30,000 bits and Wurful for the fucking 10,000 bitties. 40,000 cumulative from both of you. Envoy for the sub. Choji for the 700 bits. Uh, that's what I'm saying. I always look forward to watching your streams. Big dub. Uh, Dancer, Ram, and for you for the sub. Toasted for the 300 bits. Dude, a 20-year-old. Dude, as a 20-year-old, your Twitch streams are actually fire. Keep up the good work. Big dubs. Thank you. WW2, affiliate for the fucking five gifteds. Bobat for the 40 gifteds. Mr. Siege for the 300 bits. Oh, my God. Holy shit, chat. Y'all are fucking losing it with the bits. Not godly for the 300 bits. Love you. Bar apples are a W snack. What's the best type of apple, chat? Honeycrisp. Honeycrisp. Granny Smith. Gala. The yellow ones are disgusting. If you eat yellow apples, you're a menace, okay? No one buys those. Have you ever walked into a store and you realize why the apple, the yellow apple section is like this big? Because uh, they're dick. They fucking blow. Nobody eats them other than old people. Uh, Bliss for the 500 bits. Ranchi for the 300 bits. I'm taking a fat shit, as is like half of my chat right now. Evan and Chris for the sub tape for the 300 bits. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you? Tiptoe for the 300 bitties. Do you like front to back or back to front? I wipe my ass like this. Well, I mean, I'm like kind of crouched. You know what I mean? If you wipe back to front, you're going to have a, a yeast infection. Or, or if you're a woman specifically. If you wipe back to front as a woman, that's dangerous. If you wipe back to front as a man, uh, that's oh, that's just disgusting. That's fucking horrendous. Okay? Uh, Thomas, it's not trying to be rude. Are you balding? If so, what do you use to help it? Am I balding? Bro, I don't know. Like, I, I, I've I, given up care. I've given up care. You know what I mean? Like, I, I, I already have a girlfriend. I've been dating Brooke for, like, what? A year and five months now. Year and four months. Year and five months. You know, if I go bald, is she really going to leave me? No. <laughs> She's already in she's already in too deep dating me, you know what I mean? If I go bald, you think she'll leave me, chat? You're all saying yes. Fuck off. She wouldn't leave me. She wouldn't leave me if I go bald. DS for the 650 bets. I've already asked for this. That's you know you know how I know that? Because I already asked her. I already said that. I literally I said Brooke. This was like three months in. I said to Brooke, I was like, I was like, am I balding? She's like, no. I'm like, would you leave me if I if I if I go bald? She was like, no. I said, okay. Good shit. Fly it for the 300 bits. First time watching this stream uh, for a while while I watched it on YouTube and TikTok. You've got me through times. You're a big dub. W chat also dub. Thank you. For you, Drew, for the sub. Bacon for the 300 bitties. I want to say thanks to the guy who just gifted me a sub. Big dubs. Philly in for another five gift. It's Aldo for the 300 bits. My teacher watches your streams. Really? Toby, how old is your teacher? Toby for the 300 bits. Put me in a better mood. Uh, been watching you ever since August of 2021. Wow, that's a while. Uh, Goodly for the 300 bits. Tell bro Waffle House at 3 a.m. is a better date than Denny's. Waffle House is fire. JG, JBB for the 500 bits. Chat, what's the best breakfast restaurant? Chain. <clears throat> Denny's is good. Shitty service. Waffle House is fast. Also fire as fuck. Uh, IHOP, pretty good. Pretty underrated IHOP, I would say. Uh, I don't really know what else. JBB for the 500 bits. Uh, I watched the same poor kid get his pants pulled down three times. Why did you just stand there and do nothing? <laughs> Make it for the 300 bets. For you, Drew, for the 300 bets. My, um, oh, you, oh, you and I are birthday twins. That's cool. Rin for the 300 bets. What's your favorite movie? Don't really have one. Choji for the 300 bets. Why weren't you on yesterday? My day off. What's my schedule looking like? Exclamation point schedule. I'm live 4.30 weekdays, 2 p.m. weekends. Tomorrow, we are doing Fortnite and Val. Friday reacts. Saturday, we are playing... As Dusk Falls, which is a game where chat chooses uh, the outcome of each answer, uh, which is pretty cool. T. Nichols was playing it. Sunday reacts. Monday, Minecraft. Tuesday off. Wednesday, I don't really... Next Wednesday, I don't know what we're going to do. Today's FFVs, though. Uh, cash for the 300 bets. 
The yellow ones are bussin'. That's so cap. It was one of the best apples. I got it fresh from a market. No. Dara for the sub. Wob for the 300 bits. I got a new job as an auto body tech. Cool. SL. Dude, whoever gave me the 50, I can't see your user. Oh, my fucking God. Dude, look. See, that's the issue. Joe, what as is soon that? As I clicked on your stream, Why my does it say SL underscore ID? I, I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Thank you for the fucking 50, dude. Oh, my God. I don't know who you are. Who was that? Please tell me your name. I'm, I'm sad that I can't fucking ask, shout you out. Because it just shows the, the, the donor ID. It's like a glitch on Streamlabs right now. Big Daddy for the five bets. Denny's man back at it again. Dude, thank you for the 50. As soon as I clicked on your stream, my door fell off its hinges. Andy for the five bets. NGL for the 578. Been watching you on TikTok since 5 mil. Big Dub. Blue for the sub. WW2 for the three inch bets. Not for the four inch bets. Nathan for the sub. Dude, I got to crank through these. How do you become mod? Uh, I got to know you. You got to be VIP. or You don't have to be a VIP. You have to be recommended through mods. I have to want to VIP or mod you. There's no application process anymore. Big thing. Slump for the sub. Jen for the sub. Yama for the five inch bets. I'm 16 years old. Uh, my 15 year old friend hairline looks like a McDonald's logo. Unlucky. Uh, bad RNG. Uh, go next. Uh, Les for the sub. Good lead for the 300 bits. What's your gym workout routine? Back biceps, abs, day one. Chest, triceps, shoulders, day two. Legs, abs, day three. Day four, rest, day five. Repeat. Molly and Barna for the sub. BNX for the 300 bitties. Just turned 13. Cool shit. Uh, out of money now to do this. You don't have to give me money. Uh, donations are optional. Mr. Cleet for the 300 bits. When, where are you in one piece? Don't even know. X2 for the 300 bits. My dog got stuck over a frozen pool and you're too lazy to get her. How do I keep... How do I go get her? She's in a, she's at a frozen pool. Your dog's over your frozen pool right now, and you're not going to go save your dog. Get off your ass and go save your dog's life. Sheep for the fucking uh, sub. Cash for the for the three inch bits. I'm telling you, dead ass, it depends. They're usually ass. I can agree. I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, Denny's need for the sub for UG for the fucking five inch bits. Can we get into the game chat? Good shit. Oh, my God. I was talking the speed of light there. Fuck. Holy shit. Holy shit. All right. How much money is a bit? One penny. Is this really the fucking... Is this really the music to this game? Super seducer. Oh, God. Dude, is this supposed to be, like, sensual? Bro, I gotta turn hey, mate, this shit the fuck down. Your friendly neighborhoods... Dude, he's already... Production Guru here, and welcome to Super Seducer. I'm so excited to be getting it. Where is hands. it? We had a fantastic time creating it, and I hope that you have a real blast playing it. Hold up. Dude, is this, is this actually a guy that prides himself on pulling women? All right, there we go. All right, there we go, chat. Too cold for the sub. Four usually for the five, which bet says we're birthday twins. A lot of people were saying that in my last video. But it's also going to be really interesting, I hope, and psychologically challenging because we used real dating principles in coming up with the game. So go ahead, jump in there, and finally, thank you so much for buying it, and I hope you really enjoy it. Oh, no! <laughs> Bro, what the fuck is this game? I gotta turn down this fucking music. This shit is so loud. I swear to God, I'm gonna freak out. Bro, it, you can't even turn down the music. Holy fuck. All right, we're gonna turn down the volume there. All right, so we're gonna play, this is TOS. Bro, I'm literally, is Super Seducer 1 TOS? If it's on the Twitch directory, wouldn't that mean that it's... Wouldn't that mean that it's allowed? If it's on the Twitch directory of games, it can't be TOS. It's... I, I We're literally under Super Seducer the category. JD for the sub, X2 for the 300 bets. Yeah, bro, that makes perfect sense. If it's on the fucking Twitch categories, why would it, why would it be TOS? I got my dog. I don't think she's appreciated the amount of time it took for me to help. I couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> Wyatt for the 700 bets. Can I tell you my W Riz? So today I was at school. I got a ring pop and proposed to her. She threw it across the lunchroom and everybody was filming. So now I'm going for her friend. Her friend is a guy. Do I have W Riz? Yeah, man. You'll pull him for sure. Good luck. 
Mr. Ross for the sub too cold for the sub. All right. All right, we got to turn this shit up. Holy fuck, that's so loud. Holy shit, that's so fucking loud. Important update. Do I... <laughs> Do we read the important update, chat? They got it. They got they got me pulled in. Now I gotta read the important update. Oh god, it's taking me to a fucking website. Super Seducer 3 was banned from stores. Dude, so the third version probably had like sexual content. Alright, so Super Seducer 1's still allowed. Tama for the three bits. I'm at school. I have to watch you, MC for the sub. Theo for the three. I'm getting my grade 12 results tomorrow. Kind of worried I live in South Africa. Is your school year almost done now? P.S. for the sub. It's fucking January. I mean, your summer's probably different, though. All right, let's get into the game. Advice book. You're what? Dude, this music's unbearable. You're what? I'm going to be very loud, chat. You're walking and a girl catches your eye. Can you stop her, get her to talk to you, and make her want to see you again? Goal, instant date. All right, so we have to riz somebody up for a date. Oh, shit. I skipped it. Fuck. Oh, my God. I didn't... Talk to her from a few meters in front of her and slightly to the side. Wolf whistle at her. Pretend to be blind. Wait until she's passing you, then talk to her. Walking next to her, yo, what's up, girl? I feel like we wait until she passes. You wait until she passes. Pretend to be blind. <laughs> That's so fucked. Pretend to be blind? What am I going to pull out a walking stick? How the fuck are you going to pretend to be blind? Oh, yo, okay, now we'll go see. We'll go see. Oh, no, that was me. Excuse Fuck. me, just want to ask you something really I'm busy. quick. That failed because you gave, you made it too easy for her to just walk past you and brush you off too close to the side. It means that she will likely do that as a reflex like 90% of the time. <laughs> All right, let's pretend to be blind. Let's pretend. If that didn't work, maybe the blind trick will work. Oh, God. Whoa. Um. Very funny, but, you know, in most cases, she's just going to brush you off. Bro, this is the dumbest game ever. I already know we're going to switch in, like, 20 minutes. Batten for the 300 bets. Don't let Brooke catch you playing this game, bro. It's a fucking video game. Beer for the 300 bits. Wish I could watch stream today. I'm going to Grizzlies. I don't even know what that is. Epic for the 300 bits. That's so fucking gross. He literally, he literally just said you made it too easy for her to escape. Did he say that? Wait, can you press the same thing twice? Bro, it literally Excuse lets me. me just, it literally lets that me. That failed because you. No shit. Why would it let me play the same thing twice? Talk to her from a few meters in front of her and slightly to the side. What is this fucking music? That's correct. When you stop a girl on the street, you need to be directly in front of her and also leave enough space so that she can slow down and comfortably stop. They didn't even pan out the scenario. It literally just said I won. I just saw you and wanted to let you know you look very elegant. Dude, what are we in the 1600s? Do you have a minute? I don't know you. Hey, I, hey, don't I know you from one of my yoga classes? I think you're really beautiful. I'd like to go down on you right now. I don't know how that one's going to pan out. Didn't we go to the same college? Fuck. Yo, D is probably how you get arrested. Uh, D, D, D is probably how you either get your nose broken or you get fucking arrested. Or get bear maced. I don't think that one's gonna... Really, chat? You really want me to try D? Okay. So I just saw you and I'd really love to go down on you. What'd you Fuck say? Fuck you, asswipe. What? 
don't be sexual until you know that she would be open to it, which is never going to be in the first few seconds, especially in the daytime when she's probably just going to buy a coffee or on her lunch break. Yo, this guy has actually made a whole ass video game on dating advice. I just saw, bro, do you think anybody's played this game trying to get a girl? Like, do you think anybody's actually played this game, like, trying to learn how to get women? Like, they, they spent the 20 bucks to get this game so they could learn how to talk to women. Because, like, he's actually giving, he's trying to give advice. Like, bro, I just want to play the game. <laughs> Not psycho for the three bets. Not sure how this works, but I love your streams. Keep it up, man. Thank you. Ducky for the fringe bets. Bro, you literally said you couldn't give any more bets. You don't have to keep giving bets. Is this game teaching me how to rizz up? Yes. JD for the fringe bets. First time donating. Bought them today. Big dub. Soapy for the fringe bets. This man in the music is killing me. Uh, Kimons for the sub. And Leah for the fringe bets. Love you, Joe. Have a nice day. Thank you. Chat, what do we go for here? Epic. Yo, two inches bought this game. I think 2inch bought this game. Y'all think 2inch bought this game, chat? Epic for the 3inch bets. So far, he's given the worst advice. I think he's doing it on purpose so he can keep all the girls to himself. Uh, everybody's saying go see. Don't I know you from one of my yoga classes? I feel like that's also kind of like trying to be sexual. Because, like, what if they don't even do yoga? I feel like didn't we both go to the same college makes sense. Correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't you used to go to this college over here? I'm sure um, I recognize you. Yeah, actually. Uh, yeah, I was sure. Was it, what was it, drama class? I did take drama. I don't remember you. I knew it. I knew you looked familiar. <laughs> How long ago? Hmm, what was it? I don't know, six years or something, right? Hmm, not for me, but it's cool we had both took drama. This is okay. Um, you can say things Yo, why like... does he just have random... How much do you think he paid these women to just sit in the back? You know, they do fucking yoga. nothing. Bro, yo, I'm not playing this for three hours, chat. This, guess how long the, the average play playthrough of this game is. I'm not playing it. I, yo, we're gonna switch to Breakout 13 or some shit, chat. Yes, you are playing the whole game. Guess how long? It's seven hours. It's... it's a... We can... <coughs> we can go through a level-based thing. It's a seven-hour game, chat, okay? I don't think I'm going to want to play this for seven hours. I'll give it a few more. I'll give a few more levels. You know what I mean? I'll give a few more levels. You know, we might pop into Super Seducer every once in a while. I feel like it's an offshoot game that we'll just do. when. I, yeah, do one level. We'll do one level, and then we'll go. We'll either go to Breakout 13 or the Shapeshifting game. Because I want to actually play like a movie game, movie game. This is just like weird. I can bit just not 20 times in a stream. Well, yeah, bro. You don't need to do that. I'm going to try this out. I'll take the bullet on this one. Batten for the 3 inch bets. Too much is going to start an esports team for this game. <laughs> Milk for the sub XX for the 3 inch bets. Too much starts speed running Super Seducer. Yo, chat. Should we speed run Super oh, Seducer? Super from my college. Might be okay. Not bad. So what's your plans for today? Oh, that worked. I'm actually going to the park uh, to feed the yeah. squirrels with my friend. What? Feed squirrels? Yeah. And ducks or s squirrels? <laughs> no, just the squirrels. These we, little uh, guys, yeah? Yeah, we got them to be our friends. What do you feed the them? Like Who the fuck goes to a park to feed squirrels? I'm walking away. I'm walking away. You're going to the park to feed squirrels? Yeah, good shit. See you later. The fuck? Bro, old people. Like, what are you, 90? Hot dogs. <laughs> <laughs> um, almonds? Almonds? Yeah. That's their favorite, is it? It seems to be. That's nice. Well, they're really cute, aren't they? What if she said ketamine? What are you feeding the squirrels? LSD? It's like those people that feed seagulls Pepto-Bismol. <laughs> and then they explode. Or some shit. That's fucked. I've seen somebody do that in Ocean City before. I, like, I vividly remember somebody, like, like I saw them giving a seagull Pepto-Bismol. I was like, bro, you gotta stop. Or laxatives. And then they just shit everywhere. Bro, it's fucked up. Alpha for the sub. It's fucked up. You know what I've always wanted to do, though? I've always wanted to lay on the beach. You know those videos where they have the towel, and they lay down, and they put chips on their chest, and then they fucking grab the seagull? I've always wanted to do that. It's so illegal, though. 
It's so, you're not supposed to. I've always wanted to, though, because then I would just have a little pet seagull, and I would just be holding them. <laughs> I mean, he might peck at me a little bit. Normally, I chase them. I'm like a five-year-old when I'm at the beach. I chase seagulls and every time. Every time. I have, there has never been a time I, I've gone to the beach and I don't run at the seagulls. Ever, dude, I, and I almost catch them. I'm at the age right now. I'm peak, I'm peak athleticism. I almost catch them. I'm like this close, bro. One day. One day I'll be there and I'll, oh, I'll, be, I'll be within arm's reach of, of tackling one of them. Ethan for the three. Bro's a grizzly bear. And lethal for the fucking 5,000 bitties. Needed a bit badge. Here's my money. You really gave me 5,000 bits for a bit badge? Lethal croissant. Thank you for the 5,000 fucking bitties. Peachy for the sub. Alpha for the sub. And Ducky for the 300 bits. Conscious decision done to you, Mr. Klein, for the 500 bits. Watching the stream for a while, studying gunsmithing in Zaza land. You're studying gunsmithing while you're high. I don't really know how safe that is. And Neil for the three inch bets. Hello, Mr. Joe. J uh, D for the three inch bets. Let him cook. XX for the three inch bets and milk for the sub. Peachy and Hunter for the sub. And uh, Lethal, think of the fucking 5,000 bitties, bro. That's nuts. And cool for the sub. All right. We are very cute. You yeah, like it's animals? Fun. I do. Mm, nice. Yes. That mm. sounds fun, actually. I never thought of that. But buy some almonds, go feed the squirrels. You should try it sometime. Okay. What Yo, you his stance is just so awkward, though. The fucking hands in the pockets. What are you doing today? What am I doing today? You do most of the talking. Oof. No. Ask her questions to get her to do most of the talking. You're just so beautiful. Would you mind if I kissed you right now? Lean in for a kiss. No, dude. Ask her questions to get her to do most of the talking. Chat, why do you all want me to do B? Fuck. You're just so beautiful, and I want to give you a kiss. Whoa, no. No, 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 why no, not? no, no. I'm not trying to fuck you in the ass or anything. Just a little <laughs> kiss. Fuck you. <laughs> nah. This is the definition of creepy, the kind of stuff that's going to get you arrested, thrown out of places by security, and in all kinds of problems. So don't do it. If you want to make a sexual advance on a girl, it's cool. You do it smoothly, and you do it at the right time. Ask her do you live local do around here somewhere? Yeah. That's nice. And do you spend a lot of time in this area? Um, I do, yeah. There's a nice coffee shop just down there. Have you been there? I have, um, but I'm going to meet a friend actually, so I need to go. Okay, what's her name? Is it a he or a she, actually? Damn. In the beginning, the girl actually shouldn't do most of the talking, so you don't want to ask a bunch of questions. You want to make statements and do most of the talking yourself. Where is he getting this fucking info from? Where is he getting... In the beginning, the girl shouldn't do most of the talking. You should. Why? Like, where are you getting this fucking info from? Lethal for the five fucking gifteds. Thank Lethal Croissant if you got a fucking sub for them. And thank you for the fucking five gifteds. Big dub. Clay for the three inch bets. Bro, we're already at the sub goal. That's fucking crazy. Lethal Croissant for the five gifteds. And again, to Werfel and um, Bobat. Or Boba T. Thank you for the fucking biddies and the subs from you guys. I clapped for the five inch bets. I was at the beach and my uncle was feeding seagulls and came up and complained. After a, after a while, the guy went down or went to lay down in, on his towel and my uncle went over and dumped a bag of Cheetos on him. Seagulls surrounded him. Then a fight broke out and we had to leave. What the fuck? Crucible for the five inch bets sent a rant today. Let's see what happens. JD for the three inch bets. And Frosty for so the 1500 bitties. Today I was supposed to take my license test right. I got to the DMV, did all the paperwork. We got to my car and there's a slight tint on the windows. And the dude said I couldn't take the test. We went back. F. We went back, got my grandma's car, and the emergency brake didn't work. So now I'm taking it Friday at 8 a.m. during a blizzard. Make sure when, when, when they get in the car when you're taking your driver's test, make sure that you you just don't blink, right? Because they have to, you have to prove that you're attentive to driving. So, like, when you're driving, just, like, just be very wide-eyed the entire time, like, constantly just fucking, like, scanning your surroundings because that's what they want to see, right? They want to see attentiveness. And then when you go for parallel parking, 
make sure to inform them that you're very nervous and you've never done this before. That'll work, okay? That'll work. Frosty for the 1500 but he's wanting to give some money to my favorite streamer and YouTuber. Thank you. I'm cracked at parallel parking. I almost failed parallel parking. I failed my written. I've told you all this before. I failed my written. I failed my written test the first time I took it. I got a 76. You need an 80 to pass. Failed my written. Passed my driver's test the first time. Uh, how the fuck did you fail your written? Bro, because I didn't know the fines. I didn't know the fines. I also almost fucked up the red. Dude, there was one question. It asked me red, yellow. It was like, you know how like when you're at a stop sign, it's red, yellow, green. It asked what configuration are the colors at a stop sign. And I didn't remember if it was red, yellow, green or green, red, ye or green, yellow, red. I knew yellow was in the middle, so it eliminated the other two options. But I couldn't determine whether or not it was red, yellow, green or green, yellow, red. You're so slow. Red's on top. Yeah, no, red's on top. I think I got it right, but I still failed that first time. Cade for the sub, yellow for the fringe bets. Used to have a fight club in my old school. Now I made a new one in college. Do you want to join? No, I don't want to join fight club. What is this, the fucking movie? Oh, wow, we're literally on. Bro, he said we have to do most of the talking. I'm really about to press C, and this shit's not going to work. Parzival or Pearsival. I don't know how to fucking say your name. Thank you for the fucking five gifted. It's Parzival underscore TV. Thank them if you got a sub, but thank you for the fucking five gifted. It's XX for the three bit. Change my username. It's pronounced with an E at the end of Bodhi. What do you mean of Bodhi? What are you talking about? XXB Skizzy. What? Yeah, I was just walking. There's a nice park down there. And then I'm going to meet some friends, but I've got like 40 minutes. And that's why when I saw... Oh my fucking God, the game tabbed out. Jesus Christ, dude. Yo, after this mission chat, can we go to one of the other games? Saw you, and I thought you looked friendly, so that's why I came over and said hi. Okay. No, in the early stages of bro, an interaction, what the fuck? You actually do want to make most of the conversation so that she has a chance to relax, get comfortable talking to you, uh, snap out of the mindset that she was in, thinking about what she's doing and where she's going. So that's the right one. We might hire some bikes and go riding around the park. There's like a nice spot where they rent out bikes and it's on the lake. And yeah, whatever. but you, so. you ride bikes in there? Well, I'm English. <laughs> <laughs> you know what we do, like the penny farthing and the the suit on okay. and sitting really up up straight that's very no, fancy for bikes. I'll, I will change I will okay change, yeah. use checking out her earrings as an excuse to touch her bro that's literally this is like borderline sexual harassment start touching yourself to get her turned on find an excuse to take off your shirt to show off your physique ask what she does for a living because she looks artistic. Ask what hairstyle she thinks would be good for you. I know D is the right answer, right? I know D is the right answer. I really want to see B. I really want to see what B's going to look like. I like squirrels. Yeah? Yeah, and I like nuts. I like uh, cashews. Oh, he's oh my God. Crotch. What? What? Oh, fucking pervert. You like nuts, you said. If you like touching yourself, great. But make sure you do it in the privacy of your own home. Oh my God, it's D. And tell me what you do, because you, you look a bit artistic. <laughs> um, well, I actually work in non-profit. Non-profit? Charity, yeah. Ah, uh, I like making profit, so that's... What no, do I'm you joking, do? I'm joking, I'm <laughs> joking. I work in IT, but... Okay. No, that's cool. So you're not so focused on money, you like doing good things. Yeah. That's cool. Thanks. I'm focused on uh, money. No. <laughs> Dude, I feel like I feel like in any scenario, if you're if a woman's walking on the side of the road and they're going somewhere and you stop them, they're not going to talk to you. No matter what you look like or who you are, like they're not going to speak to you. You know what I mean? Cuz that's just weird. Like imagine you just you the second you meet someone, they ask you out on a date. Like, that's odd. No matter how well they speak to you, I'd be like, this dude could be a literal fucking serial killer. Like, this man could actually go and murder me on this date.
Like, I don't understand. Like, I, that's, in my opinion, I feel like that's what a woman's going to think, right? You, Some random dude starts trying to riz you up. Either they're going to think you're a creep or a serial killer. One of the two. Like, I mean, you might not be, but they're not going to think that you aren't. Meek and Jade for the sub. That's fair. Because I think he can be creative too, so. Sure, yeah. yeah. If Brad Pitt Oscar walked up to me, I'd sit with him for an hour. Okay, well, that's Brad Pitt. Gorilla for the sub, Abby for the sub. What someone does is that kind of usual question that we always ask, but in this case, you want to make a guess, make an assumption. It makes it a little bit more interesting. And if you choose something to do with fashion or art, it's always a compliment for a woman because it kind of says that she has style. Are you single? Ask her name. Ask, ask her name, then say it's your name too. Look up her skirt. That's how you get arrested. Introduce yourself. Probably introduce myself. D chat, stop putting... Bro, y'all really just type D. Oh my god. Oh my... I'm not putting that. I'm literally... I'm gonna ask her name and say it's my name too. Because I don't know how the fuck that's gonna pan out. What if she says her name's Rosalina? Oh really? Me too. Then what, are you going to have to lie to her later on? What's your name? Alexa. No way, you're joking. No. That's my name too. I'm oh. Alexa too. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. Isn't that crazy? It is crazy. No, I'm joking. My name's Richard. Ah, uh, But it's well, still good to meet you. You too. This is a funny take on it, so of course you need to get her- That was not funny at all! That was stupid as shit! That was stupid as fuck! Bro, he really said this is a funny take on that. Bro, just say your name. Just say you're Richard. What the fuck? Name, and in this case- Somebody said, don't be a pussy, Joe. You should have gone D. That's not being a pussy. That's me not trying to get the character fucking arrested. Mirror for the sub. Gorilla for the sub. You know, you followed up the very common boring question with a little bit of a joke. Of course, it's important that you can uh, pull it off, you know, say it in a cheeky way. And it's another thing where it's guaranteed oh, to get a laugh. And it's a question that you always need to ask. So it's a great one. Go out and try it. What kind of things do you like to do in your free time? Mm, I actually don't have a lot of free time and work. Yes, you do. That's a fucking lie. You're going to the park to feed squirrels almonds. It, you have free time. You have free time. Okay. You're going to the park, not to feed the birds. You're going to the park to feed the squirrels, okay? You have free time, right? You definitely have free time. There's no way. You might not have a lot of free time, but, like, you're literally, you, you've been here for now 10 minutes talking to this random dude. You're still going to go to the park. Broad daylight, mind you. This is, like, noon. So it's not like you're at work right now. It's, like, noon on, like, a Tuesday, and you're just walking to go feed a fucking squirrel. You have free time. I work a lot, so when I'm not working, I like to be outside. Yeah. Um, yeah, I try to be outdoors as much as possible. I actually bike where you mentioned. Um, okay. Yeah, I just try to be outdoors. So you're one of these active people that's always doing stuff. <laughs> yeah, it's hard for me to stay sitting down. Not couch potato. Well, every now and then, but in general, no, more active than okay. down. I'm kind of semi-active. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Like, I do some active stuff, but actually I prefer it when, you know, someone else plans everything and they, like, come to this. And I always say yes. Okay. But given the choice, I often just chill at home. That's I like fair. chilling. But, like, here's the thing. This is the most boring conversation I've ever seen in my entire life. You know what I mean? Like, he's trying to teach somebody how to, like, riz up a woman. Dude, like, they've been sitting here talking about the most stupid fucking shit for, like, ten minutes. Can I have your phone number? Sell her one of your hobbies. I love how casual you look. I hate girls that always try to look their best. Oh, yeah, what a good one. <laughs> listen, I need to meet some friends, but I'd like to see you again. What's your number? That's the one. Okay, listen, like I said, I'm meeting those friends, but mm. why don't you give me your number and we can um, keep in touch, maybe yeah, meet sometime? Yeah, sure, sure. There you go. Cool. Ooh, you <laughs> fun. Have number. fun. You too, Ooh, see ya. She gave me a fake number. Ooh, she gave me a fake number. Well done, you got a fake number. Yep. Mm, not good enough. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Sell her one of my Have hobbies. Have you ever tried climbing? 
you know, like on these walls. <laughs> I've heard of it. Um, I've always wanted to, but I haven't yet. You know, it's very cool. We've got some place that we go to. I've only been like four times, but it's really fun. Very good exercise and just really cool. So you should definitely try it. Yeah, I would like to. When you're speaking to girls, it's good to be passionate about something. And a good choice is something you love Yo, to do. what the fuck is she looking at? She's not, bro, I li like, she's literally now, just what? staring. They're both staring into the abyss. Why are they behind him? Why don't you see if you can go out and sell someone on it, make it so that they're smiling like, yeah, I'd like to do that. That sounds great. So it's, it's the right option in this case. Okay, so you said you like biking and rock climbing. Yeah. Um, any other like outdoor activities? Yeah, loads of stuff. Um, yeah. Racket sports. Like tennis? Um, yeah, tennis and also squash. You know what squash is? <laughs> it's the English thing. I don't know I about mean, most it, sports no. were invented in England, obviously, but I think they play it everywhere. It's, um, it's like when you're, you're usually inside and you've got a wall like in... Squash? I've never played squash. Have you ever played squash? It's the game where you hit a ball across a wall and it has to like pass someone or some shit. That's how you win. Mr. Clean for the 300 bets. This is 2-inch Riz. Nimble for the 1,500 bitties. Uh, this game is fun as fuck. Hope school and all is going well with you, Joseph. Thank you. Uh, Ariana for the 300 bits. My boyfriend just broke up with me. Oof. All of my friends are busy and I have nobody to talk to. I feel so damn lost. I really loved him. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that. Um, my advice to you or my what I'm going to say is... Maybe they, you guys weren't meant for each other, right? I know you might have loved him, but you want that reciprocated. Uh, if he felt like you guys weren't meant for each other, then there probably had to be some sort of thing in your mind, too, where you kind of had that energy as well or felt that energy as well. I would say take time to move on. You'll find somebody else, right? Life is short. In that short amount of time, you're, you're going to find somebody that is meant for you. Okay, uh, there's 8 billion people in the world. You will find somebody better. I, I'm telling you right now, you'll find somebody better. No doubt about it. Uh, also, don't let it phase you. I know this might seem like a big deal right now, but in the scheme of your life and in the scheme of the universe, uh, someone breaking up with you, especially while you're pretty young, I'm assuming you're pretty young, uh, it really won't matter. Like, Five years from now, you're not going to give a fuck, like, at all. Like, five years from now, you'll look back at this, and you'll be like, yeah, that guy broke up with me. I really don't care. Like, you care now, you won't care in five years. That's how I always, that's how I always look at things, right? If you, if you are stressing out about something, look, look at a five-year perspective, and if it's still going to stress you out in five years, do something. If not, it doesn't matter. <laughs> If not, like, I'm not saying it doesn't matter. I'm saying, like, it matters right now, but in the scheme of your life, it won't, right? Like, you will get over it. So I know you feel shitty right now, but please don't feel shitty for a while because you dwelling on it is only going to make it worse. You got to look at it at the perspective of your life's short. You don't really want to be dwelling on this for a while. And five years from now, you're not really going to give a fuck. Uh, reverb, reverb for the 300 bets, or the 500 bets. Uh, I was giving some of my... I, I was given from some of my female co-workers is to not ask for their number. Give them your number. Mr. Klein for the 500 bits. How many pull-ups or chin-ups can you do? I can do at most 30. Full lock pull-ups probably in a row, probably like 35. Liam for the 300 bits and Ethwar for the sub. Maybe the last. I don't really know. I've never tried. Front to the sides and in the back. And you okay. can hit the ball like anywhere. And it, I think it's the best exercise. You're constantly You're running. You're skipping and this. Yeah. Say you are an ass model, then try to touch her ass. Programmer and be passionate about it. Programmer, and that is really boring and you don't like it much. Programmer, but switch to talk about life philosophy. D. Yeah, I work in IT, but I wouldn't say that it's my passion. I think that in life it's important, you know, earning money is one thing, but really what's important is you know, your social connections with other people, mm -hmm. friends, family, developing yourself. So, because there are so many f important things that we forget about and the career really is just a small part of life, right? Yeah, absolutely. You agree? Yeah, I do. 
If you really hate the question. Y'all trying to get me to do the duck. Why is my middle finger so bent? Holy shit. Oh my god, I just cracked it a little bit. Maybe it's back in place. I don't know. Uh, mobile for the sub. Question, what do you do? Because your job's really boring. Then it's very easy to say, you know, I do this, but that's not important. And talk about something that you're really passionate about, something that you really care about, something that's really interesting to you. The key is not to kill the conversation by saying something that is just boring and shows that you don't have anything going on in your life. So turn it You've around. You've been boring this, this whole fucking like time. Job. So yeah. do you always stop girls in the street? Yeah, actually, yeah, quite often. Actually, yeah, quite often. This is the furthest I've ever gotten. I don't really know what to do now. No, of course not. Never. Somebody redeemed flex. Not too often, but when I like the look of somebody and I'm single, so why not? Only if they look like they're dying to be fucked. Dude, the yo chat, really? Really? You want me to put that? I feel like no, of course not, never. It's B or C. B or C is the right answer. A, no. D, definitely no. But let's pan it out. Well, you know what? There's a special quality I look for, and I would only stop girls if they have that exact thing. So okay. it's quite, you know, something special going on. Do you want to know what it is, the quality? <laughs> yeah, I do. Well, it's just when the girl just looks like she's dying to be fucked, and basically... Excuse me? Yeah, like she's just ready to bang right no, there and then. No, that's vulgar. That's oh, really vulgar. Vulgar? Yes. No. It would be way worse than that. She would punch him in the face. It would be ten times worse than that. Oh my god, that's not W Riz. Bro, that's fucking terrible. Yeah. That's totally cool in the game, but. In Somebody said I'm grounded, help me. Get the fuck off my stream, you're grounded. Get the fuck out of my stream. Get the fuck out of my stream, you're grounded. Why are you in my stream right now? You're grounded! Get out of my stream! Whoever's parents, can you hear me? Your kid is on their fucking phone. They're grounded. They're grounded. Get them out of here. Life of Braden for the sub. Rebel for the Thringe Vets. White for the Thringe Vets. Your new nickname should be Joe the Garden Tool. What? Do you eat mac and cheese with a spoon or a fork? <gasps> Depends what mac and cheese it is. Liam for the Thringe Vets. Mr. Klein for the Fiverr Vets. Uh, Rebel for the Thringe Vets. Tyler for the Thringe Vets. I am a 15-year-old Aussie. I've been hitting the gym. And I see some smoking women and I need help positioning my backside to attract. What are your thoughts? What? You mean like your back muscles? Just do pull-ups. I don't know what you're asking me. Also, do y'all eat mac and cheese with a spoon or a fork? If it's thick mac and cheese, eh, most of the time I'm most of the time I'm using a fork, right? If I have a spoon, I'll use a spoon, right? But the big mac and cheese, you got to use a fork, right? Like thick mac and cheese, fork. If it's thin like craft mac and cheese, you could use a spoon. It's a bit odd, uh, but it's not that bad to use a spoon. I would use a fork, but I mean, if I had a spoon, I would probably just use a spoon. In real life, I must tell you that you shouldn't even swear at girls, never mind getting sexual. As a man, you have... A responsibility to treat women with respect and always make sure that they feel better after the interaction with you than they did before. No matter how rude they are, they've got a right to be rude. And if they're not rude, then even more reason to be polite and make them feel good. Bro, together aura 501. For the fucking 25 gifted subs. Holy shit. Clap it up. Clap it up. Thank you for the 25 fucking gifted together, Aura. Thank them if you got a sub from them. That is a fucking shitload of subs. I can't really scream because my voice is a bit fucked. But thank you for the 25 gifted together, Aura 501. I very much appreciate it. So does my chat.
Holy fuck. Thank them if you got a sub, and thank you for the fucking 25 gifteds, dude. That is insane. Thank them if you got a sub. Just gave out 25 fucking free subs. Thank you for that. Helps out the stream, helps out my chat. Thank you for the fucking 25 gifteds together, or a big dubs for that. Rocco for the sub. Holy shit. So many subs today. What the fuck? Thank you for the fucking subs, dude. Oh, yeah. I forgot I still have to answer this question. I'm going to do C. No, not often at all, but I think when I'm single, when mm -hmm. I like the look of someone, I figure why not start a conversation because you never know what will happen. Yeah. Could become friends, could date, or just have a nice interaction. Why not, right? Definitely. This is the right choice because actually it's honest and it's disarmingly honest. So it's going to take her back a little bit, but it's going to also show that you're telling tr the truth, that she can trust you and show that you're confident enough to, to say that instead of making up some rubbish. So it's the right choice. Well done. Listen, I have a few minutes. Why don't we go grab coffee? Listen, I need to make some friends. Give me your number, period. Jesus Christ. Listen, I need to make from some friends. Or listen, I need to meet some friends. I'd like to see you again. What's your number? You know, I live near here and have the apartment all to myself. No. Bro, I feel like coffee. Coffee is the answer. Or B. But I did B last time and it was shitty. I got the fake number. A. Listen, I've got a few minutes right now. So do you want to just grab a coffee? What'd you say? Yeah, okay. Great. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, let's go. We did it. We fucking did it. The very best result After in the fucking daytime 10 is hours. to go for the instant date. So that's correct. Well done. Uh, if you just leave and get the number, you know, that's okay. But it's much better if you can say, listen, I've got time now. Why don't we do something quickly? Notice that it's just a quick thing. So it's quite easy to say yes to. Bro, no damn way. That was level one. That's correct. One. When you stop a girl on the street, you need that to... That was level... That was level one. Holy shit, dude. How many fucking scenarios? That was an hour for level one. There's fucking 30 of them, dude. Holy fucking shit. Get me out of this game. Get me out of this game. Yo, which one are we playing now? Breakout 13 or the shape-shifting detective chat? 